This is the Novette Dry and Wet Handheld Vacuum Cleaner and in this video I'm going to show you around it, show you it in action and let you know my thoughts. Okay so let's have a little look around it. On the front of the handle here you've got a red power button and three indicators to show the level of battery charge. You've also got a release clip for the front, I'll show you that in a sec. You've got a battery release button on the bottom in case you want more than one battery. And on the back you've got the, where the power cord goes. If I press down that, the front comes off. This is so you can empty it. And this is the filter. Comes out, also comes with a spare one of those. And you can just empty it straight into the bin. Really simple. This just sits in here, it doesn't clip or anything, it just kind of wedges in. It's got a rubber seal around the outside. And that just clips back on like that. You turn it on by pressing and holding the power button for two seconds. And turn it off again by pressing it again. Here we have the accessories that come along with the vacuum cleaner. You've got the crevice tool, just plugs onto the front of the vacuum like that. I'll show you in action in a second. You've then got a rubbery tool for vacuuming liquids. Yes, this can vacuum liquids. That fits on the front like that. You've also got a brush tool, probably good for getting in nooks and crannies in cars or something like that if you've got pet hairs. There's also a spare filter, so this can replace the filter in there when that one gets bunged up. You've got a cleaning like brush, you probably can't see that very well, there you go cleaning brush for cleaning inside all the nooks and crannies and you've got the charger. So let's test this vacuum out in a few different scenarios. As you can see it's pretty good at picking up crumbs, it's got all the big ones really easily. I had to go over it again to get the little ones ingrained more in the carpet though. The crevice tool makes it really easy to get into the corners like this. Water next, and I was actually really impressed with this. You can see it sucking up into the tank there, flying around, and it's made quick work of it. On to the car mats. Now, this is always a tough one for vacuum cleaners. The dirt gets really ingrained when you stand on it. It's picking up the loose stuff really well, but I'm going to have to go over it again with the crevice tool to get the more ingrained stuff. So let's have a look at some of the tech specs. It's a 100 watt motor, 2200 milliamp battery, Charging takes about four and a half hours from completely flat and it lasts about 30 minutes. They claim it lasts 30 minutes and to be honest I found that to be pretty accurate. The charger is 14.8 volts and you can get it with a charging dock although mine didn't come with it so I'm not really sure what's going on there. The brush tool's done a great job of getting in all the nooks and crannies in my dashboard in and out of the vents and that kind of thing. You're not going to be able to give the car a thorough valeting with this, I'd recommend a proper vacuum cleaner for that. However, for maintenance, just going, going over quickly, this is really useful. So overall guys, if you're looking for a cordless, lightweight, handheld vacuum cleaner for doing around the house, vacuum, vacuuming up after kids, doing a bit on your car, I'd highly recommend this one from Novet. It's usually available for just under the £40 mark on Amazon. I'll put a link in the description below to where you can buy it. And if you found this video useful, please hit thumbs up and hit the subscribe button down below to be notified of my latest videos. And I'll see you in the next one.